Welcome back Team Fever, back again with another video and I'm back with another, well, a first, The Circle. It's about to be a really quick, you know, recap of The Circle because I watched a few more episodes. If y'all have not seen my first The Circle US, Netflix The Circle US video, I did it inside of a mukbang and I also talked about the challenge, Big Brother, and Love and Hip Hop. If you only want to see The Circle spots because the video is kind of long, it's like 20 minutes or more than 20 minutes, a little bit under little bit over somewhere around 20 minutes I did put the circle logo where I started talking about the circle so the circle logo will be inside like the top left or right corner one of them and you will see that logo when I begin talking about the circle and I talked about the circle last so once you see that logo you can just watch the video for the rest because it's just me talking about the circle check that out I really want to talk about the circle with y'all I am on episode five or six now I think Inside that video, I did talk about how I wasn't a fan of Antonio. I didn't really care if he went home and this, that, and the other, but I still kind of don't because he did. He was the one that ended up leaving, which it kind of, it surprised me when the game took a left turn for him, but then like it didn't surprise me when he went home. I knew he was going to go home. The ratings or the rankings, it was literally him and Sammy in last place. They went from first to last. That is crazy. Antonio was right. He didn't want to be an influencer, and he thinks that him being an influencer is what cost him a game. And I kind of agree. I think he played too hard. If he wasn't an influencer, he wouldn't have been able to go to Mercedes and say, oh, let's look out for each other, all this, this, that, and the other. And then he got that question where it was like, who's your main alliance? He should have said someone. He should have backed somebody and be like, that's my number one. So that he can ensure he got a number one rating, ranking. Because to me, if you get ranked number one by anybody, you're probably not going to be last. Unless everybody rates, everybody gets ranked number one. You know what I'm saying? Because if it's eight people ranking, right? So you can be numbers one through seven. If you are rate, rated num, ranked number one, and somebody else was not ranked number one, you probably would never be last. But I guess last don't even really matter. It matters who's right, because he still could have went home if he was like second to last or something like that. So like, I'm really just talking about nothing right now. Mercedes, uh, what the heck? I was a fan of hers, but she's starting to play too hard. What is going on? Like, I had a feeling he was gonna meet Mercedes. But I hate it they meet him because when Mercedes and Antonio met, I feel like that's kind of like what Mercedes was saying, why she's catfishing, is what I would be doing. I said that in my mukbang is like, I would play as myself and just with like a model, like I would be a male still and just um, my pictures would be a model or Instagram model, but I would still have all my same, you know, attributes. But then... I became not a fan of Mercedes because Mercedes started saying, I only use different pictures. Everything else about me is real. No, it's not. If everything about you was real, you wouldn't have been flirting with Antonio. Everything that you said was not real. The way she talked, that is not her. She is catfishing for real. For real, for real, catfishing. And the other guy uh, that's playing as Rebecca, I forget his name. He got like a weird name, sorry, but he did. Uh, he might be playing the best game, because he's laying low. He doesn't have like a main, main alliance, a number one, or nothing like that. He's just in the background, like, he's not in no drama. He's not really like doing anything. I think he's real extra though. Like, is he putting on for the camera when he in that room by himself? Somebody who I don't think is extra, somebody who I think is being their self and is my favorite, was my favorite in my mukbang, and still remains my favorite, is my boy. Chris, he, he's the coolest one to me. Uh, he doesn't, he's not really smart when it comes to figuring this stuff out though because he thought Mercedes was telling the truth when she said that uh, the guy didn't go meet her. Like she was really like pushing that off on other people but the pe people she was talking to wasn't even really suspecting it. Like nobody really cared. Like somebody's a catfish, y'all got rid of two people who were real. And something else they said inside this was Sammy. Now that they're focusing on getting Sammy out. And I think somebody said she's the next cutest one. I'm like, oh. So y'all are just getting out the cute people. Like, so maybe I shouldn't play as a model. Not that I'm saying that I think that I look like a tree monster. I keep saying that. But I don't look, I'm not a model, so I would use somebody who is a model as my picture. Like, I think that's what um I saw him just like Karen, because Karen said the same thing. <laughs> like, I'm not ugly, but I would use her. <laughs> but yeah. Uh and I like the new girl. <laughs> 
Ah, uh, I just thought of that challenge they played with the cakes. That was hilarious. I want to do that. I really want to do that challenge, like, for real. But the cakes, my boy Joey, that cake he made, and he was taking the challenge serious. You could tell he was really taking it serious. He's like, no, I don't. And I do think that's his real personality. So I like, I like him. And he was like, I'm so sorry, Antonio. <laughs> He was like, I'm willing to bet my mom that he is a catfish. Like, he was doing, like, I'm, I'm a fan. And I like Shoe Bomb still. I like everybody. Oh, there's a new guy. I, so I turned the show off when the new guy was coming in. So I don't know. But I know he's he's doing pretty much what I'm doing too. He, I guess I'm not, it's not an original strategy, but it's original to me. But everyone's doing it. They plan as they sell, but just put out a better, oh, I almost got a better look at it. But just look a different way. You know? Actually, I think I might just play it myself, myself, because. I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, I hope the new girl doesn't leave right now. She is flirty as hell, though. She needs us to slow it down. She's flirting with the boys, the girls, the everybody. She, the only person she hasn't flirted with is Shoe Bomb. And Rebecca tried to flirt with Shoe Bomb, and Shoe Bomb was not even. Shabam, whatever. He was not even. Shuba, Shuba, I don't know his name, but he was not even catching that she was flirting. Out of all the original cast, who I can see winning is probably Shubam, Shuby. I'm um, sorry, I watched the episode a while ago, so I really forgot their names. I don't see Mercedes winning. I don't, I wouldn't be surprised if she left next, actually. Oh, and let me talk about Sammy. Sammy is so arrogant. I just hate, I'm ready for her to go. I wouldn't be, even though like they targeting her because she cute, I would not mind if she left next. She is just so arrogant to me. I just I kind of don't like her. She's got like a mean girl. Like I know she has resting bitch face and all, but she just seem like, because she's not a mean girl at all. She's really nice. She's really, really nice. But her just attitude is just like arrogant, and I just don't care. Like That's how she seem, and I'm not a fan. I don't like it. But people think I'm arrogant, but. I don't see how. I love the show and I'm gonna apply for season two. I know my mukbang, I was saying I only wanna be on Big Brother, but I mean, I do. I really wanna be on Big Brother. I really wanna do Big Brother. Even if I was to get evicted on night one, which would suck, I really wanna be on Big Brother. That is my dream. That's the dream. Even if I was part of a twist, which I don't wanna be. I wanna play original Big Brother and win, at least make it to final three. Yes, final three. Ain't no at least make it to week two or at least make it to jury. Oh, this, this video is about to circle. Sorry. Feel bad a little bit for Antonio because he was being genuinely himself. He had nothing. He wasn't hiding anything. Same with um, Alana. They were themselves and they got evicted. Or, come on, big brother. They got eliminated. Or, what is it called? Blocked. The circle is called blocked. The challenge is eliminated. Uh, for nothing. Because they were cute, I guess. Because that's what they said. They get all the cute people out of you. Cute. So at that point, who's the ugliest one? Because they probably going to win. Right? Well, I guess that's how it go. <laughs> In the circle. Is the circle over, by the way? Because I don't know. The show might be completely over right now. And I'm just like talking about a show that been aired. I don't know. I'm trying not to look it up on Twitter because I don't want no spoilers. And I'm avoiding them good. So right now, y'all, leave more leave comments for us to discuss the show. Please don't leave no spoiler. If I go to read a comment and it said, hey, Alana won, I'm going to be pissed off. And I said Alana won because she's not there no more. Yeah. Other than that, um, I think that's it. Did I talk about everybody? I would like for Joey. No, Chris is my guy. Chris is my guy. But I, I like Joey. I do like Joey. Joey's real. Joey's real. Chris is real. Shabam. Is everybody real? Sammy does fake flirting. So fake flirting is not real. I just think Chris is the bomb. He, he's the best one to me. I, he, I'm the biggest fan of him. But that's it, y'all. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, share this video on all friends social media. Let's discuss Netflix's The Circle US Season 1, Episodes 1 through whatever I'm on. 5, I think. I don't know. I'm at the episode where the next, where the second new person comes in. Let's discuss all that inside the comment section down below. And until next time, y'all, catch ya later.